King Carter, King Carter, King Carter, I fly. King Carter, King Carter, King Carter. The show was Step King, a baller named Carter Day. I pod on the point guard, calling plays. I'm a rookie, but I'm going through another phase. You'll see when your coach screaming, yo, he got a change. Usually over Twitter, we have a lot of fun. But DeMarcus Cousins isn't that type of guy, so you know he has to call me out. It's time to drop dimes on him. The game is tied up at 5, and Watson makes a big mistake by trying to go behind the back with no space left. Anthony Davis picks up the treasure and goes in for the crazy slam. He doesn't even deserve a replay for that. We're going to skip that. Watson is putting on the pressure early. It seems like he's mad that I got that steal. But Ryan Anderson sets the nice screen and goes in for the layup. That's my dime. That's 1 out of 10. I'm going to get Eric Gordon involved early, so I'm going to call a nice little play for him, try to get him set up. Now, Ryan Anderson is going to set a nice little screen here, which really didn't work too much to perfection, but the switch did come. Eric Gordon pulls up for the shot and gets it blocked. Passes it off to Ryan Anderson. He gets it blocked. That was a terrible offensive sequence. We have to try to take a commanding lead here, so we're going to play the inbound real quick. Tyreek Evans does get the inbound pass. I played Watson for a fiddle, thinking I was going to go back door, and I nailed a three-point shot. You know it's cash. Come on. Remember when I told you guys I was trying to get Eric Gordon involved? Well, it's not working. The man is shooting terribly right now. He's only two for seven. Sacramento is out on the break. And guess what? Eric Gordon gets a nice block. He said, if I can't get no offense, I'm going to play good on defense. It seems like we are in a whole nother city right now. Instead of being in Sacramento, we are in Blockamento. Everything is getting blocked. But Watson does get the three-point shot after the cleanup from uh, Baamute. Now that Watson is on the bench, it's time for us to play the bullying game. Me and Drew Holiday are going to call for a nice little double team, trying to get the ball loose from McCullum. Now right here, I get the nice little cookies. Drew Holiday, I don't even know why he's in the play, but I told him, give up the ball and let me get that slam. Look at that. Now I almost told Drew Holiday, fuck out the way. He was in the way, you know, he would have messed everything up. Now that I'm subbed in that shooting guard, Watson is destroying Roberts, man. Our backup point guard is losing all confidence. Everything that Watson is doing on this court is to destroy Roberts. Check out this play right here. All Roberts did was just receive the ball and he just gave up the cookies to Watson. What's going on here? Now, of course, Sacramento is out on the break and we can't stop that. So Patterson gets the crazy dunk. Now, of course, it wasn't a crazy dunk. It was a okay dunk. You know, he could have did a little bit more. He could have double pumped it something, you know, added a little bit of flair to it. I'm trying my hardest to stay in front of Marcus Thorin, but this dude has crazy ball handling skills. He goes in for the floater. Anthony Davis destroys that. So, you know, I got to reward the big man. So, me and the brow link up real quick, calling for a nice little pick and roll. The double team is going to come, but he's still trailing to the basket. And you know, I had to throw the alley oop. It was only right. Come on. Where's the replay? They hating on us right now. Now, Sacktown is only going to what they know. They're going in the paint. They are destroying us there. They're even destroying us on rebounds. Check out the offensive work by Cousins. Even though he gets his shot block, he still gets the bucket from getting all these rebounds. I'm looking for an open shot as I play possum on the inbound. I get free, get a nice little three-point shot to go, and it falls. It's definitely cash, but there's one problem. Sacktown isn't giving up. Sacktown will not let us score a point without coming back down and showing them who's boss. They came in today with all intentions to put boot to ass, and it's nothing we really can do. Every time they pass it to the paint, it's an easy bucket. Check out DeMarcus Cousins as he gets the two points to go. Like, it's nothing we can do. He's been stand up dunking all over us. Luis Scola been destroying us, and oh man. Let me remind you guys about Roberts. Yeah, that just happened. Another monster is blocked. We are in Blockamento. I don't know why, but we are in Blockamento. CJ Watson just got two easy points on me, so I got to come back down to pay him back. And guess who got a little bit of that work? Don't you dare look in the crowd. You know what happened to Marcus. You know what happened. You want to challenge me on social media. You're going to get your behind dunked on all night long. It looks like I received my invitation to the block party a little late as DeMarcus Cousin comes over and plays volleyball with my layup. But Sacktown not done. They're going to come down on the other end, give it over to Luis Scola. He's going to take the jump shot, and guess what? It's cash. He's 7 for 7 right now. Terrible. Sacktown is up 17, and I'm totally frustrated, so I'm putting the moves on CJ Watson. It looked like he just came out of his jersey as I get that nice little Euro floater to go. Check out this move. He almost came out of his jersey. 
It looks like DeMarcus Cousins is out of his element right there as he takes the long range jump shot. I don't know what he was thinking, but check out this nice change of direction right at CJ Watson taking the jump shot and you know it's cash. That's what we do. That's what I'm doing and that's what I'm going to be doing all night. The pressure is still on, but I don't know what CJ Watson was thinking right there. He threw himself into the pick, but guess what? They left a man open, hand down, man down, Eric Gordon for three. That's my 10th assist. Social media challenge, what up? DeMarcus Cousins, what up? Come see me in the locker room, fam. You know what time it is. I'm still trying to put CJ Watson on his butt. I'm trying to put the moves on, but I lose the ball and literally die for my life. I put my life on the line right there and nobody got the ball. And guess what? They give up two points that easy. The biggest mistake of the game is trying to guard me at half court. Anthony Davis cutting to the basket, getting a two-hand jam. That's my assist. You got to stop playing up so far. You got to hang back a little bit. Hang back. I'm still trying to get my teammates involved, so I'll give it off tomorrow. But Ben McLemore annihilates that layup. Can he get some fries with that punch, please? This right here is one of the first times that I'm not starting in the fourth quarter. The coach really knows that I'm trying to do everything to get my team back in the game. But I'm just burnt out, man. It's terrible. Now, I'm looking at my teammates as they watch the game. And I notice everybody's eyes on the court. But nobody really came here to play at all. <laughs> I, I promise you, I do not know what Miller was trying to tell me as I get up to go to the announcer's table to check in, but we can only do better if I'm in the game. Now, first play offensively for me, I have to set the tone, so I'm going to go straight at CJ Watson's chest, go right at him with a nice little right hand layup, but I did cut my eye at the ref for the foul. As the double team comes, I pass it over to Tyreek Evans, wanting him to drive to the lane, but he passes out and Ryan Anderson settles for the shot. Now, of course, we already know he got it stuffed. We're in Blockamento, but if we can't get nothing going offensively, we got to do something defensively. So I'll call for a 2-3. Now, even though that three-point shot didn't go in, we have to grab the rebound. We don't care about a block. We care about rebounds. Now, if we're not going to grab any rebounds, stuff like this is going to happen. Cousins post up, shoots the jumper, and it goes in. Now, Luis Scola will never admit this, but I broke his ankles on that killer step back. Y'all know I did. Y'all know. My father always told me that pressure busts pipes. So we're going to call a double team, try to get CJ Watson out of his element, and he turns over the ball. Now, of course, I'm out on a break, and they wait to pass it to me, but I still get a nice little dunk to go. Even though it's not a kid slam cam, I still feel awarded, you know? Your boy going up for the nice little tomahawk, and look at the celebration. <laughs> now, I got to show you all this play right here. Now... Even though we're back to man to man, guys still have a little bit of that 2 3 in their system. So they do get a nice little block on Demarcus Cousins. But they fail to get on Marcus Thornton and he drains the dagger. This game has been over since the second half began. But guess what? I'm still fooling in this game. I'm still going to the rack trying to score. And I get the nice little finger roll to go. Now, I think defensively, Sacramento thought I was just going to hold the ball because nobody really popped up to come and get that block. We are in Blockamento, right? Aren't we? I'm just saying, you know, I thought they, I, I think that they thought I was going to give up. That's, that's what it was. They thought I was going to give up. But guess what? I'm not giving up. So I get these nice little cookies real quick, you know what I'm saying? Oreos. And I put up a nice three-point shot. And guess what? It's cash. Now, of course, that didn't matter because uh, the game is still over. I still lost. But, you know, it is what it is. But uh, one thing before I get up out of here, guys, sports commentator March Madness 2014 has begun. So you guys can go over to Game Face Studios YouTube channel and check those out. Or you can click the link in the description, the very first link to the playlist of round one. Go ahead, go vote for your favorite commentator. You know what I'm saying? As they move on in the rounds. But this is IKC signing out, and I'm going to see you all in the next video. Peace. You amassed 53 points tonight. It must have been a bit conflicting though, I mean, you gotta feel good after scoring so well, but it came in a loss. It's tough to celebrate any sort of individual accomplishment when it didn't come in a win. I thought we would be able to pull it out tonight too, but it just wasn't meant to be. I just gotta take any positives I can out of my play and try to apply it to my game next time out. And we got some things to work on as a team so that no matter what I'm doing, we have a better chance of winning the game. We only got ourselves to blame for the result tonight. Only ourselves, man. Year. 
This is Siri. Thank you for watching and be sure to like this video. For more videos from this particular mode click more videos. If you want to see more content from IKC click subscribe. Oh and don't forget to follow IKC on Twitter and to like his Facebook page. This is Siri signing out. Peace.